We're back. <laughs> okay, to those of you that weren't in the last completely failed stream, uh, welcome for the first time today uh, to the Black Beanie stream. My name is Murphy and we are playing some Minecraft and you are listening to me talk as well as my, my chair. Uh, but yes, Brennan, welcome. 21 Bricks, welcome! Rap, good to see you again. Avery, good to see you again. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. Uh, let me get my controller plugged in because I don't feel like doing this with the uh, thing here. Let's see. I just got to go pull up the model and then we'll be set. There we go. Where is this outrageously loud noise going? But quite sure what to make of it. Oh, Fallout 4, I screamed the whole time is a video. Okay, gotcha. As a totally random comment, like, I've been using this, uh, Elite Series 2 controller for the last couple of weeks. This thing is awesome. Like, hands down, the best controller I've ever used. And I wore the hell out of the original Elite Series controller. <sighs> what type of clock tower did you make? Okay. Cables. Cobra, welcome. And welcome back, Carter. Welcome back, Casey Paul. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome, Moy Mini PSN. Like a small yet kind of big one. Okay. Ooh. Okay. <sighs> This might be a shorter one than the one we did yesterday, and I think Rap was saying that um, at least a significant portion of the stream that I did yesterday actually got deleted, which kind of sucks. <laughs> Carter, I do remember you from Star Wars Battlefront. We were just there. All right. If you see me pause a lot, it's because I'm over here uh, moving around this model, 3D model that I've been using. So let's add some things. Uh, into our inventory here. Uh, I think we agreed on black concrete for the building here. We'll go ahead and put that in there. Let's get that cursor off the screen. I also want solid stone blocks. There we go. Okay. A little. All right. Oh, this is the natural texture pack.
don't know why this game doesn't have like concrete stairs and things like that. It certainly would make this a lot easier. Yes, please! Concrete slabs! Con like, if there is a block, like a construction block, like stones, sandstone, concrete, there should be a stair slab, maybe even a chiseled or a pillar variant of it. Like, if I can have smooth andesite, I should be able to have smooth concrete. Uh, I've had a few requests to do the CN Tower. I'll say the same thing that I say to everybody. Like, I'll... <laughs> I'll get around to it at some point, I promise. Doesn't matter of actually doing it. Let's do gray concrete instead of, uh... That guy. Canadian National Tower, gotcha. It's the really, really tall one. I have, yes. That was pretty good. Why don't we like it? I thought it was fun. I thought it was fun and funny. I mean, it was better than the majority of Marvel movies, if I'm being entirely honest with you. I talk about boring. Buddy, the first Thor and the second Thor are two of the worst movies in the entire Marvel anthology. Like, they're, they're terra bad. I don't know what you've been smoking that makes you believe that. I'm kidding. The first one was pretty... The first one was decent. I liked Anthony Hopkins as the dad, like, introducing Loki. Like, easily one of the best characters in the whole, like first three phases I guess no clue like Anthony Hopkins as Odin is just an inspired choice 
So she wasn't like 800 years old. Well, yeah, because it, um, it introduced the Tesseract, but I mean, if we're going to play that game, like, if we want to single out which movie is most important to all the Marvel movies, it's Iron Man, bar none. Like, that's the be-all, end-all. If that movie wasn't successful, then none of it would have happened. I mean, the one that they followed it up with later that same year, 2008, was The Incredible Hulk, and that movie was awful. But that one also introduced us to William Hurt's, uh, General What's-His-Face. The guy who's in Tony's face the whole time in, a uh, Civil War. But of the, of the original, like, four Marvel movies in Phase 1, uh, Iron Man 1 and 2, Thor and Captain America, my favorite one's probably Captain America, the first Avenger. I thought that was pretty good. But he's also probably one of my favorite characters, just in the Marvel pantheon. Or at least the, the movie's interpretation of him. I think they did a really good job with Steve Rogers. But that's just me. I feel like it wasn't until Thor Ragnarok that Thor actually had a godforsaken personality. He always just walked around talking like this. It was so depressing. And, like, the best moments from, like, the first Thor movie were, like, the fish-out-of-water sequences. Like, when this god is walking among, like, normal people. And it's funny. Apollo! Welcome! The Hulk from... Our parents' times? Yeah. I remember Eric Bana's Hulk, Ang Lee and Eric Bana. It wasn't awful, but yeah, it wasn't good. Um, <laughs> the ones from our parents' time, though, with Lou Ferrigno. Ooh, I've met Lou Ferrigno. <sighs> wasn't the nicest guy. Almost like he never got over Arnold Schwarzenegger beating him at the Olympia, but it's neither here nor there. What was what? What are my thoughts on the 9-11 attack? It was pretty freaking bad. It was scary, man. Like, we, I lived through that stuff. It wasn't exactly the best time to walk around, especially if you're in the DMV. And by that, I mean the Delaware, Maryland, and Virginia area. DC, Maryland, Virginia area. Uh, because we had a... Look up the DC Sniper. That was going on right around the same time, and that was terrifying. Like, you could not go outside without feeling like you were going to get shot. And, like, one of the people that he shot... Um, he shot them at, a, at the mall that I went to when I was a kid. It's just like...
Definitely not the Department of Motor Vehicles. I uh, know, I grew up in Virginia. <laughs> Polar, you were eating a seal. He had to go hunt for his food. For his dinner. Now, we were just talking about the DC sniper. The whole world changed. Think about that. One year into the new millennium, and the most, arguably the most significant event in American foreign policy happened. It's like... The way we think about and talk about terrorism is completely different than it used to be. This wall should be back a little bit further. Yeah. Why I had it all the way up here? I think it's unfair. And hell yeah, they changed. Oh, the polar, the last streamed, uh, the last stream, sorry, um, ended because I was having some severe technical difficulties with the, uh, with the game. I couldn't get it to, like, work and then also have a single Chrome tab open over here on the other screen that I could read while I was playing the game. Um, I just think that has to do with the fact that it was constantly changing um, its resolution. But what are you going to do? I think it's unfair that the buildings were destroyed. I also don't think it was fair the way that the United States responded by attacking a country that wasn't responsible. And by befriending a nation that um, actively aided the attack to begin with but again I'm not here to uh, talk too much about my politics I just think that it's a shame that it had to happen or it's a shame that it happened at all and honestly like there's a reason people are nostalgic for the 90s because things were so much simpler back then it was the last great American decade It's been recession, war, and civil rights issues ever since. We're not gonna. We're not gonna do this. We're not gonna debate semantics. We're not gonna get into who did what or why. We're just going to acknowledge that it happened. We're going to acknowledge that a lot of bad things happened as a result of it happening, and we're gonna leave it at that. And we are going to pay tribute to the buildings themselves with this. No, 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 don't worry. No need to apologize. 
We're just here for a good time. Sorry, Polar, let me approve your comment there. As far as I understood it, I thought a Muslim was a practicing, was someone who practiced Islam. But again, like, I am, I'm not Islamic, I am not a Muslim, I can't speak to any degree on, like, what is or what isn't. So I'm not even going to pretend to do it. But I think that, um... Polar's heart is in the right place when he says that we are uh, shouldn't be calling out anybody as responsible or ostracizing anybody for something that happened 19 years ago when the facts have been smudged like it's nobody's business about the, the entire thing since then because it was kind of, it was interesting being in the United States after that happened. It was... Anyone wearing a hijab? Like, people who looked an awful lot like this got really, really angry at people who looked like that. Regardless of what faith they actually practiced. Take your time, Polar. You're not late, X78. I started really late. We were trying to do a Star Wars Battlefront, uh, an OG Star Wars Battlefront 2 stream a while ago, and I just... I couldn't get it to... let me see. I couldn't get it to literally... Like, this was the problem. I had a Chrome tab open on my second monitor. I had the game open on my main monitor. And every time... The game started a level or started a mission. The Chrome tab on the right would disappear and move like behind the game on my primary monitor. It was just driving me nuts. No worries. Okay. Can I take off my beanie? No. It is glued to my head. More specifically, can I? Yes. Will I? No. gonna use some dark oak because again there are no dark pieces here <laughs> you guys are gonna be so disappointed when I take off my hat and it's just gonna be hair you're like oh ah <sighs> These stairs? What's up, Ryder? Eh. It be what it be. I've already built them. I'm not getting rid of them. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of the effect I'm going for. I just wouldn't kill them to make concrete stairs and all that stuff. Like, Philip, hello. Oh, I started building them because I kept getting a lot of requests to uh, build them and I've never actually built the whole complex before. 
I've built the towers before, but they were like really bad and it was a long time ago. One thirty for you. Whoo! And don't worry, Philip. I don't know why I'm yawning. rebuild the old OG World Trade Center and there was no such thing. See, that was what was interesting, because for a long time, everyone around the states was just kind of like, so what are they gonna do? Like, I mean, it was, it was the assumption of everyone that they would rebuild it, but I mean, you never know, right? Like, it took a long time for the new one to get finished. But the new World Trade Center complex, like all the new World Trade Center buildings, are unbelievable. They're amazing. Obviously none of them are as, you know, big and as magnificent as Freedom Tower, but some of the architecture on display is just, it's awesome. It really is something to see. The path has been completely redone and that's really good. Um, the memorial is incredible. So from a design perspective, honestly, I think I prefer the new to the old, but not necessarily certain I can advocate advocate for the way that uh, we went about getting the new. Again, it's just, it's a big shame. You go get yourself some food. One point. Hello, Paradox. Hold on. I got to approve your uh, comment here. Yeah, 11 years. Took a long time. Yeah. Absolutely all of Virginia public schools are closed for the rest of the school year. So for the next like two and a half months. Schools are closed in Texas too. Gracious. Uh, maybe I should take nine years to build this one. Yeah. Yep. Pretty crazy. Tight rope to cross them. Food, do what you gotta do. Oh, I don't know. What was my favorite tower to build? Uh, it took nine years, just it... I mean, you had to plan the damn thing. And on top of that, you had to build it in Lower Manhattan. And money. We were... Ugh. It didn't take very long. It took like seven years after 9-11 for the economy to crash. Oh, 
Well, Ryder, I appreciate you coming by. Yeah, Virginia is definitely closed for the rest of the year. Northam, uh, our governor, just um, announced that earlier today. Uh, I'm going to have to disagree with the popularity of the World Trade Center. It was, an, it was a, world, a global landmark. Um, it was a pretty significant thing. Oh, the economy's already crashing. My stock portfolio looks like crap right now. <laughs> no. But again, this isn't a place for talking politics. This is a place for building dope-ass buildings. When do I go live? Uh, I don't really have a schedule. Um, what I would suggest is that you uh, go check out our Discord, uh, Black Beanie Gaming on Discord. I normally post sometimes within minutes, sometimes hours in advance uh, when the next stream is going to be, and I always provide a link. So every time I go live, I post it up there. And again, that's Black Beanie Gaming on Discord. Pretty cool. We got a handful of uh, lovely little people checking it out sharing memes and whatnot. And it's mainly just a place right now, since the channel's so small, like people go there and we like to share pictures of our Minecraft builds and stuff. It's pretty dope. Yeah, notifications works too. Polish. <gasps> you have the best sausage. I swear to God, kielbasa is a godsend. Like, if it weren't for Polish people, like, Chicago wouldn't have any good food. <laughs> like, I swear to God, like, Polish food is so good. It's ridiculous. Uh, link for the Discord in the description of the video? Uh, I can try. I don't think I can, I don't think I can share links. Um, if you go to the about section on my YouTube channel, it should be there. The Deutsche Bank building. You know what, rap? I had that problem a lot growing up with my, uh, with my elders. And now look, we're in solitary confinement, all of us practically, so it's like, what are we supposed to do? Not play video games? I'm gonna play some video games. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna play some video games. So, I'm just gonna put these on the pillar bits here for now. I might not get more complicated than that because the way it wants to do it underneath these areas is like comes out like this. You know what I mean? And I don't have enough space for that and it would betray the aesthetic and all of the measurements we have to do that. So I'm just gonna put an upended stair piece and just call it a day. <laughs> Good enough for government work. For the love of God, come on. Alright, what are you guys saying? The Patronus Tower. I've heard that before. Which one is that? Which tower is that? You guys are going to learn this about me. I am 
if I don't see the name over and over and over again, I will forget what the name of things are, what the names of things are. Oh, is that up on your YouTube channel? Patronus Twin Towers is dope. Is that, uh... Ooh, I want to see. I'm going to Google it. Patronus Towers. I'll probably recognize it the second I see it. I'm just terrible with names. Oh, yeah, duh. Oh, man. Yeah, I'll definitely build those. Sky bridges are so underrated. Why don't more buildings have sky bridges? We've got a bunch of them here in uh, Richmond. You can just like, oh, there's the street. I'm just going to walk over it. Go to this building over here. It's like, wow, what a novel concept. <laughs> well, Philip, get back to posting. If you're going to be a bean, you need to post. Polar, welcome back. I'll tell you what everybody should do, and that's go subscribe to Polar. Alex and Jetsers, welcome. <laughs> Polar always says no. No! Okay, well, if you don't go subscribe to him, just give him your love. He deserves it. He is the OG bean. Polar is Jack and I am the Beanstalk. Okay. <clears throat> China. Christ. Okay. Tickety tockety tickety tock. Speaking of China. Okay, so if I want to get these. Proportions, right? Did I get any sends from YouTube that you... No, I haven't gotten anything like that yet. You see, here's the thing. Like, the the main way to get in trouble with stuff like that is to declare that... Is to declare market word and do everything in your power to make your content appeal towards children and then provide content that is not safe for children. It's a betrayal of trust kind of thing. And YouTube has this thing, it's like, is your content made for children? And I'm like, no. Even though most of the people that watch my content are probably young, it's putting it out there. I may drop the occasional F-bomb. Some of the games I play will definitely be rated M. It's just how it is. YouTube used to be the best place for creators, man. Like, I sometimes I really wish I had started this YouTube channel years ago, back when uh, you could pretty much just do whatever you wanted. Not that I would need the leeway, because honestly, this is a pretty tame channel. But, I don't know, it just it felt so vibrant and creative and... It's like every day, like a new, like, creator, like a new animator, a new, like, really innovative vlogger, a new... It wasn't... It wasn't all, like, makeup tutorials and, like, Jimmy Kimmel videos, you know? And I've got nothing against makeup tutorials. Absolutely nothing. Like, tutorials on YouTube? Like, I wouldn't have any <laughs> subscribers if it weren't for tutorials on YouTube, but... What I mean to say is that, like, the content has become a bit 
homogeneous. So it's like it, it just gets hard to differentiate between certain content creators, which is why a lot of my favorite creators over the years are no longer on the platform, and it makes me sad. Jimmy Kimmel and Jimmy Fallon. Both of those guys are all over the place on this platform. I'm sick of seeing them. If I had to pick one that I really enjoy, it would be Seth Meyers. Used to be Stephen Colbert, but he's just a little goofy for my tastes. I think Seth Meyers has better writers. I should say that. It's nothing against Stephen Colbert. Seth Meyers just has a better... Uh, Seth Meyers just has a, uh, a better writing staff. I mean, YouTube doesn't actually use real people to moderate content. It's all done by an algorithm, so if that video probably just doesn't conform to some random al algorithmic equation, it's just an oversight on behalf of a computer. But you'd be surprised at the crap that's on YouTube that you'd be able to find if you went and search it. If you went searching for it, it's actually fairly despicable in a lot of cases. Oh, Etika. So sad. One, three, four. Okay. Trust me, I'm not. There's a... Uh... One of the ways that you kind of get introduced to that stuff is word of mouth. Um, but there's a, um, a documentary series on uh, Netflix right now called Don't Fuck With Cats. No, Keith, I do feel bad. It's always sad when that happens to someone. Someone who's going through... Or if someone who's experiencing a crisis can't get the help that they need. And all of us kind of just sitting there staring at his implosion. Like, I'm not saying that we as a viewing public are responsible for anything that he did in his own time, but it's... It's just sad. Dude, I know! Polar, it's insane! Like, I don't... Like, seriously. Over the last couple of days... It, like, over the last month, I've had... Banana, welcome! We're, Banana, I'm sorry, we're on a weird topic of conversation right now in the chat. Um, but yeah, what the hell was I saying? Seriously, what the hell was I saying? No, there's a... <laughs> Guys, I literally can't remember what I was saying. Someone remind me. No, okay, I was talking to... I was saying something to Polar. Um, yeah, over the last month, it's been absolutely insane. Like, 130-some subs just in the last month. I have no idea where you people came from. I am so happy to see you, though. We're gonna make this community something worth being a part of. You are all my lovely little beans. I will put you in a pouch and cher cherish you forever.
That looks more like it. There we go. Oh, well, thank you, Kasim. Kasim, however you want your, uh, however you would like me to pronounce your name. Get Bean <laughs> on Rewind. Oh, gosh. Oh, goodness. Yeah, Polar, that's kind of interesting. Like, I feel like you've been around forever, but, I mean, really, you just kind of, uh... Why the fucking shit are you building this, you incompetent ass fuck? I want you guys to answer this question for him. Hi, Calculate One. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm so happy that you have something nice to say to me. I can't think of a better way to spend your Monday evening. You guys watch, uh, Calculate One is actually like, <laughs> that, that, what's the name of that other guy who does tutorials? Jazz or something like that? It's him in disguise, he's trying to discourage me. You might think that me building this is rude. It was 20 years ago. Is he one of those people that says it's in poor taste to uh, kneel for the flag, but wipes his mustard-covered mouth on the 4th of July with a, an American flag napkin? you build one of the most important buildings in history? Oh no! So good. <sighs> Philip, I hope your connection gets better. to say. So yeah, I only build buildings I don't like in Minecraft. Buildings I hate and want to sully their reputation. There's just absolutely no logic there. That's what I do when I start my day. <laughs> I'm gonna build a, a good building in Minecraft. Just so I can stick it to the people who love America. Oh my god, Polar, what's his channel like? 
Is he a flat earther? If the earth is round, how come my bread is straight? And that's what some people like. Uh-oh, banana, are you okay? Julian, welcome. Sorry I didn't uh, see your comment earlier. This, ch <laughs> this channel does not exist anymore. Nice. Polar's literally been here since I started streaming, which was a couple months ago. Um, and if he said that he started watching the channel when I posted the Freedom Tower tutorial, then that was a while ago. I did that last year in like July. Um, so he's seen his, like he's been here with me and there's been a lot of like really random people that have come in and just done weird things. And it's like, what are you doing? There was this guy who came into the chat once and just started screaming, Help me! Help me! I need help! And it's like, are you in like, are you in physical duress right now? Like, do you need someone to actually help you? Because I don't think the YouTube comment section on a stream of somebody with like 110 subscribers is gonna help you out much, man. You're gonna need to get a hold of somebody else if you want some help. Because I'm trying to build something here. We build towers. We're building a community. Boop. Dio Brando has said twice anal shit. Is there any other kind? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> oh my god. As opposed to armpit shit. He might be coming back with this Dio Brando account. I blew, like I don't know if you guys can see it, but I uh I deleted the message. If I can guess where you're from? North Dakota. I don't know. I have no idea. I mean... Should I? Polar, I should make you a moderator. I remember there was this one time that somebody came in and was like begging me to make them a mod. Uh. <laughs> yeah, there was that guy who was doing that. I can't, it's seriously, like, they're just. Some people are just weird. <laughs> it's like, why, why do they say the things they say? Pakistan, cool. Are you Chloe Price? Why don't you like emojis? Uh, that's what I was doing, Keith. Um, I was putting all the buildings in one map. Um, normally what I do is, like, when I make a tutorial, I kind of want to do each in their own little map. Um, unless you guys would rather me build them all together. For the tutorials. It's just easier to film the tutorials and get, like, all the good viewing angles. And what I could do... Oh, God. Sorry. 
What I could do is, for B-roll, just get, um... Eh, I'm, I'm spitballing. <laughs> I'm thinking out loud, you guys don't need to hear me do that. With white concrete. That looks good. I take it back. I no longer like it. Something white that I can use. Um, I don't like diorite. Urgh. It's just it's the closest one that I can find. Every time I look at diorite, it just makes me want to eat a Hershey's cookies and cream. Canada, eh? <laughs> Lester, welcome back. Long time no see. Hunter gun, I grounded your friend. You mean I put him in timeout? I mean, I look at it this way. As long as I can understand what you're saying, like, everything is fine. I was about to say, Polar, you know what to do. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and make Polar a mod. what that does. Don't abuse your power, Mr. Bear. Polar, you are officially my first mod. <laughs> I have power. Oh! I wasn't paying attention. Apollo, I like that comment. <laughs> they called me a madman. Harrison, hello. Thank you so much for joining us today. Tonight, today. In the stream. <laughs> Polar has the infinity gauntlet on his hand. Us saying pretty please is all that's keeping him from snapping his fingers. It's the Spider-Man nearly ripping it off. <laughs> then who's the Holy Spirit? What's my favorite song? Ooh, that's tough. Ooh, that's so tough. I kind of go through phases, if I'm being entirely honest with you. I have, like, a song that I listen to a whole lot, and then I move on. I just heard a noise, that's all. I just heard the noise again. Here, hang on. I'm going to go check it out. Give me a sec. <clears throat> I will be right back.
It wasn't a ghost. I was trying to spook you guys, but it's really awkward in this little corner that I'm, like, shoved into. <clears throat> yeah, man, it's pretty cool. Welcome to the power. Yep, it's uh, like stuff will come in, and the majority of the time, Polar, it's like it's 100% harmless. It's like if you mention subscribing to a channel, it'll like hold it for review. So all I gotta do is just be like, boop, and approve it. Um, or if like someone says something like, I think someone mentioned like gun once and then it got held. It's, it's kind of inconsistent, but it is 9.08 p.m. in Virginia. The Minecraft Man, hello. I'm playing your game, sir. Wait, I'm using a keyboard and mouse. Ugh. Yep, Eastern Seaboard Time Zone, whatever it's called. Hey, cool. Welcome back, Philip. Good to have you. 1 a.m. where you are, good gracious. Which one of you is in the Netherlands? The Netherlands? Yeah. Okay, so, so like, Kahoot is actually pretty great. Um, my girlfriend uses it in pharmacy school. So it's a really good tool. Um, one thing that a lot of businesses and schools use, especially now because everybody's quarantined, is uh, Zoom. But honestly, like aside from like webcamming, Discord's way better. I mean, look, if if you, this is basically it, like everything that I use already knows where I live. Um. And honestly, if you had the computer know how to find out, you'd find out. It's not like I'm giving out my address. And I am an... I am just... I'm a complete recluse. So it's like you're never going to see me walking out and about in the streets. I live at 1234 ABC Drive. Whoop, I gotta get the uh, model back up here. Hold tight. Where did I put it? Boop, there it is. Boop, there it is. Okay. Who has to fight? Oh, because Keith is the general. Butterfly rocket. Hold tight. I didn't see your uh, your post. What'd you say? <laughs> three World Trade Center. Um, which one is that? Uh, the modern Three World Trade Center. I'm assuming is what you mean. Um, bum bum bum. Kyle's back and Carter is back. Uh oh. I promise Carter the tutorials will get better as time goes on. Keith, I could literally just ban you from the channel, and then I could become the general of Polar Army. If Polar has the army, I am the cause to which he is wa for which he is waging war. <gasps> Cookies! Yes! Should I do a face reveal? Hold tight. Tea, bread, sausage, bacon. Mmm. Sounds good. 
Ice cream! Oh, man. Stop talking about food. I haven't gone <laughs> grocery shopping in, like, two weeks. I'm scared to. I'm glad I've got toilet paper. See, Polar, I'll let you take care of that one. So, I just need... Okay. <laughs> Onion reveal. <laughs> Shrek to the virus. Would you stop spreading for five minutes? Uh, swearing? I'm okay with swearing. Um, the channel's not at risk for anything right now, so... <laughs> Unless someone's saying something, like, offensive, you know what I mean? But, like, if someone says, like, oh man, I just, I love Minecraft, it's fucking dope, you know, like, I'm fine with that. But if they say something, like, bad... You'll you'll know it when you see it. Asshole means ass. <laughs> Get out of me, swamp. Hey, what color is this on this? Black. Bliggity bliggity black. So what I'll do. Damn it. Two, three, four. Keep in distance. A actual a little bit more than halfway, so probably back a little bit more. Try it. Seven. Five. Oop. <laughs> AIDS, herpes, gonorrhea, scabies, and crabs. See, you can say all that stuff and it's fine. I'm telling you, man, YouTube moderation is a joke. <laughs> you tell him, banana. You tell him. Your parents hate it? Are you watching with them? Wait, are you referring to what I said or what they said? Hold on. Oh man, I missed a lot in here. Yeah, let's try to keep it... relatively in control. Yeah, we could talk about Shrek, but it should be a, it should be a, uh. You guys will find out all about STDs when you're older. And not from health class.
18 people in the stream. Well, actually there's 16, but. All right, does that need to be a little bit bigger? Yes, it do. It do indeed, indeedly do. Toaster is a horrible word? Oh, Polar, I don't even know what's going on. Like, I looked away for, what, like 10 minutes? Five minutes? And <laughs> the chat, like, I don't know what's going on in the chat. You guys remember that one random time there was like a hundred or some odd people in here? And I was like, that got a little ridiculous. Well, they don't ban, they just, uh... STD comment? <laughs> yeah. Looks good. Yeah, and they don't, I don't think they ban anybody, but they, um, they definitely uh, remove your eligibility for monetization. Not great. Couple of really, really dark areas here. Like these two are extra dark. I don't know why that's the case, but they are. see about that. They're like these uh, curved bits that go across the top of all of the uh, things on the bottom. <clears throat> 21, welcome back. I was about to say, like, I've, I've completely lost all control over my chat for the first time in forever. I think Polar actually was, like, I think he was going to live stream a while ago. I don't know. Polar, did you ever go through with that or no? Or did you not have the uh, software necessary for it? Chicken ramen. Mmm. <laughs> Cade, please. Love it. I love it. Would I rather have a bunch of paper cuts and jump into a pool of lemon juice or put a toothpick under your toenail and kick a wall? Oh my god, the paper cuts! I can handle the paper cuts, but oh my god, the toe! Oof! Yeah! Yeah, I agreed. Paper cut. <laughs> I can handle the paper cut, like... Get me, get me in the lemon juice and then I'll get right back out. Oh my gosh. The toe thing, like that just... Ugh. Fair enough. Or you could kick it with the back side of your foot. If we're going to play the semantics game. Alright. 
<sighs> so here comes the challenging bit. <laughs> Shrek ate his toenails. Um, <laughs> Donkey ate Shrek's toenails while he was asleep. <laughs> uh, yeah, here's the thing. Mm, no. Here. So. Come on, there we go. Anyways, like I was saying, so the windows on these buildings here are very, very slender. So it might be difficult to use something and still get glass in there. Well, let's not... Let's not practice things that could get us banned. Ugh. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, the windows are bigger. And it is shorter. Yep, you're absolutely right. Same general design principle, but like the windows and everything are completely different. Um, I'm in the uh, windows for the building. Anything but honestly nothing. Welcome for joining. What do I do for a living? I edit videos, I write some blurbs, I do that stuff. I do miserable work that shows up on websites every now and again for pennies on the dollar. <clears throat> okay. Bubble 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 bubble. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, I was about to say the stuff underneath shouldn't be too bad. Um So I'm probably just gonna do it like that. I just, I wanna be able to put glass panes in between here and have it look normal. And I'm just not gonna be able to do that with um, a slender, a, a skinnier material than the concrete bricks that I'm using. I think in the end it'll come out looking just fine, but you gotta make some concessions every now and again. Well, that's unfortunate. I broke my number one rule, which is to always have an odd number. <laughs> Fudge, okay. So whenever I run into this problem, I always do the same thing. Find a nice spot in the middle to make a wider window. That'll be what we do right there. Let's have a little thicker piece here. Can't believe I did that. That's my number one rule when it comes to making things in Minecraft is always use odd numbers.
What are you hooligans talking about? Uh, da, 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 da. F. Patrick. Bacon tastes like poop? I disagree. <gasps> what is how he's building the Twin Towers? I have like only one wall left to build and then I realized that one of the walls was one block longer than the other. Oh man, that sucks. I've had that type of stuff happen to me before. <laughs> Somebody give 21 bricks a bowl, please. You eat those apples, it'll keep those doctors away from you. I think Polar is still here. Some comments are still getting um, approved. <sighs> I would say Polar is here. Hello, Turkey from the USA. Thanks for stopping by. Yes, I think that is a given. Uh, no 9-11 jokes. Like, I'll tolerate one or two of them, but it should be mentioned that this is not the place for them. Oh, wow. How is this one odd? That is very confusing. I do. Is it because it's even on the bottom? Oops. Well, I don't know how that works, but it works. So let's throw caution to the wind and roll with it. <sighs> it's just a little disrespectful, all things considered. We're not going to hold it against you, we just prefer that you don't. 
And when I say we, I mean me. If you are, just be careful that you don't start. That's basically all I can ask. Because <sighs> that's really all I want out of this. I just want people to be respectful of one another. It's 4.33 in the morning over there. Good lord. Well, they used a lot of that footage that they, uh, that bystanders filmed. A lot of that's in the, um, museum now. Rap, as far as I know, it's to highlight the absence of the buildings. Because the, the holes are like the exact outline of where the buildings were. <laughs> Maybe get some new friends, Unezi. Also, thank you for stopping by the stream. Always nice to have new friends. I'm ultimately not worried about what color the windows are going to be. I'll make them pink just to spite everybody. Wandering Trader. Wandering Traders are the ones with the alpacas, right? More people than the last stream? Yay! <laughs> yeah, the 9 11 Memorial Museum is really, really, really cool. The first time I ever saw one. Like, I had no idea what it was, so I just killed him and the alpacas, and then I was like, oh. Yeah, no, the back of the fire truck is completely smashed. It's kind of, it's, it's also one of the older style fire trucks. Like, it's really, <sighs> for a lot of people that were alive for a while before 2001, it's weird to look back at that time and see how different everything was, like the style of stuff. Plus one sub. Thank you, Ekin. 
I do not prank my friends. Thank you, subscribers. We love you. Welcome. What you can expect from me if you have subscribed is... Not a whole lot of energy. Not a lot of yelling. But some nice chill streams. Mostly Minecraft with the occasional deviation. I was doing all sorts of gameplays uh, and recording them for a while, but I mean, I'll take 300 views on any random stream for Minecraft as opposed to like 12 views for some other game. One, two, three, four, five. One, two. It's not a lot of fun to stream to an empty chat room. You know what I mean? This is why I like doing these Minecraft ones, because everybody shows up. Boop, 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 boop. Boo 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 boo. I think if it had, if it had only been the one and it collapsed, I mean, the damage that it did to the buildings around it was unbelievable. Um, I don't know, part of me thinks that they would probably have... I doubt that they would have just gotten rid of the other one. If it still stood, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, a long time ago, a plane crashed into the side of... It was an accident, but a plane crashed into the side of the Empire State Building. And they just fixed it. But, I mean, a building the exact same size as the Empire State Building didn't fall and shed debris right next to the building. So there's... Really, like, unless you're an engineer of some sort, like, I've got no way to calculate the type of damage that would be done. I'd like to think that they wouldn't get rid of it, but it might not have been feasible to keep it standing. All I know is that when I visited New York the year after, um, every building in the area was covered in black tarp. So. All right, outline done. That's right, people are still dying today. <gasps> and yes, Kyle, that's how you spell Marriott.
Yeah, I know what you mean, uh, Philip. I know what you're looking at. Uh, it's all about what I can feasibly accomplish uh, in Minecraft without crowding everything up. Because I'm still going to take some, some license with some of this stuff. It's, like I said, like I've said in the past, like my goal is always to make an unmistakable match for the real life counterpart, but not to make it photorealistic. There's that old meme, Jets, jet fuel can't melt steel beams. It's like, it doesn't have to melt them. It just has to ruin their structural integrity. Integrity. And then when that junk collapses, it's just... Nope. Bye-bye building. Yeah, no doubt about that. Uh, I've tried building a city in survival, but I mean, as you can probably tell, my favorite brick is quartz. I just like the way it looks. And that's incredibly difficult to get large quantities of in uh, survival. really been a big survivor or survival player in Minecraft. It was like I was never in on like the sky block sky block craze and all the other stuff. I've always just been I want to make models of buildings. That's it. Never really been interested in anything else. I keep forgetting that... <laughs> I keep forgetting that, I, like, I've said, like, a bunch of times that, like, I, I want to do a Fallout 4 mashup. <sighs> oh my goodness. I'm yawning so much. To do something.
I mean, probably would. Can't imagine it wouldn't be. Razer keyboard? Yeah, I don't really bother with products from Razer. They make good laptops, but... I don't use a laptop. Uh, no, this is the natural texture pack. <clears throat> yeah, there's a certain aspect of those old airlines. It's pretty cool. That's what color.
Yeah, that's a terrible phone. Apologies for being so blunt about it, but that's just not a good phone. <laughs> First ever iPhone. Nice. Oh, there's nothing quite like your first smartphone. It's a pretty cool experience. I wish I could go back and get one for the first time all over again. But you realize that they're really just a big pain in the butt government spy on you through them and you're just like, can you not? And they're like, no, we're gonna. Instagram, yes. Murphy uh, BBG093. That's M U R P H Y BBG093. Although I would much rather you join our Discord, which, if you go to the About section on our channel here, you'll find a link for it right there. Discord. Needs to go out a little bit more. guys i'm gonna get the outline for this building done didn't take too long and then once that's done we're gonna go ahead and log off but only once we're done with this uh this building here saying there Lego Star Wars <laughs> uh, yes yeah, stay home and don't worry about paranormal they matter only so much as you give them importance Yeah, I'm not going to have this stream up for too much longer. I'm going to finish the outline for this. Like, there's just the generic framework. Ooh, and we're going to go ahead and call it a night. 
And then uh, tomorrow afternoon, afternoon my time, um, I'm probably just going to hop back into Minecraft here because we'll get uh, this one and then that one. And then we'll do the hotel and then this one here. And I don't know if I'll do interiors. I, I wasn't doing interiors on the last one. <laughs> World best PC server. Uh, I don't know what time just yet. Um, like I said, I'm in the middle of uh, editing the next tutorial and I'll probably be working on that like 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. type deal. So maybe after five or maybe a little earlier. And that's Eastern time. Eastern US time, that is. So, yeah. Yep, thank you so much for stopping by. Anybody who feels that like they gotta go, man, go ahead and go. I won't be far behind you. It's about 10 o'clock here, so I'm gonna finish this frame and then wrap it up. Wrap it up like leftover low main. Ooh, banana's building the spire. <laughs> Sound like you're drunk, Uncle. Well, I apologize. That's bringing up some bad memories for you. I should do that one of these days. Do a drunk stream. I just get giggly. But that's my problem. Like, I don't... I don't really get giggly or manic when I'm drunk. I just get sleepy. Like, getting drunk just makes me want to go to bed. Alright, let me zoom out a little bit so we can get a good view. Rap, is that your way of telling me that I should make the interiors to these buildings? It'll take a long time, but I can do it. Thank you very much, Atchison Animations. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Thank you for stopping by. We're actually getting ready to wrap up here. Um, but your support means the world, so thank you. All right, so this is looking pretty good. I'm really, really digging the proportions on everything compared to how it looked before. This is This is turning out a lot better. I'm glad we decided to plan everything out in advance. <laughs> fill up all of it's just a placeholder um once we start building the buildings everything will start coming into focus um yes so goal for tomorrow finish up the frame for that one just so enough it looks like that one finish up the frame for that one and maybe the hotel over there or maybe this one um it depends on how how tall we want uh jose Jose, Jose David, I hope I pronounced that correctly. Um, the tower here, including the spire, is uh, 256. So it's just the basic height limit. I haven't removed the height limit or whatever. Um, okay. Yeah, Rap, I'll try to... I'll try to do the interiors. I'll, I'll see if I can't find some pictures. Or if you guys find some pictures, share them with me on the Discord. Um, and yeah... Okay, so we got a good view there. This is what we've accomplished so far. The majority of this was done yesterday. <laughs> the, All right. Thanks so much for stopping by, everybody. Uh, for those of you who were here during the original Star Wars Battlefront 2 stream, I'm sorry that that one didn't work out. It's just technical difficulties were driving me nuts. Um, yes, check out the Discord. Check out Twitter. You know what to do. Like the video. Share the video. Save the video. Cherish the video. Marry the video. Grow old with the video. Divorce the video out of spite do whatever you gotta do thanks so much for stopping by guys i'll check you in later okay uh, we'll be back tomorrow with more world trade center building good night polar good night rap good night philip and good night kyle Boop.
Mr. Bean out.